great support and I don't believe I haven't been here for so long, but I'm gonna plan on coming back more often. So thank you. Yeah. Listen, listen. A few questions we gotta ask you. You say you don't get back that often. What do you what do you make of it? Because obviously it, it changes a fair bit, Birmingham. Yeah, I think it's absolutely changed. Yeah. Absolutely. I mean we, we can't complain. It's always been the same track when you get in, it's trying to get, get to trying to find where you going to do. You got lost on spaghetti, you didn't get lost on spaghetti, did you? I don't know. <laughs> Uh, you're doing the NIA tonight, yeah? Yeah. Is anyone going? <laughs> you need a ticket, someone there needs a ticket, Oz. <laughs> so what, you, what can people expect tonight? Is it, is it going to be... Black and Roll! Yeah. And the new album, Black Rain, most successful for what, 20 years? It's been six years. Six years. But apparently, that, so I've been told the most successful, apparently, for a long while. Your managers tell me this. No, liars. Okay. <laughs> I love doing an interview with this man. You never know what's going to happen. So, um, listen, what, we're here to give you this star, which is under there, right? Um, yeah. Yeah, use the mic. Uh, and you've got one of these in Hollywood. Okay, yeah, what, this what... one means more to me than any. Yeah. Yeah. Done it. I was waiting for that. We got that one out of the way. That's good. Um, I'll, I'll take you back a while. Remember the Alamo when you piddled on the Alamo? I didn't piddle. I took a piss. You took a piss on the Alamo. That's fine. I'm trying to keep it clean for these nice ladies and gentlemen, but yeah, you can get away with it. I can't. What if someone, because it happens on Broad Street, we love Broad Street, it's a beautiful place, but let's face it, people get a bit tanked up and they need to go. What if someone piddles on Ozzy Osbourne? Great. <laughs> I'm sure there'll be more than piss, there'll be all kinds of things over here. <laughs> so it gets the Aussie stamp of approval, does it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, cool. Oh, no, I would if I was here, I wanted to Well, it'd be but... rude not to, wouldn't it, really? Uh, the family, first of all, you're an Aston boy. Uh, are you going to be going to see the folks and everybody while you're here? Yeah? Well, they're all here, so I haven't got to go very Jack's far. over there. Jack, give us a wave. <laughs> Jack over there in the pit, ladies and gentlemen. There he is. And uh, how are the rest of the, uh, the family? How is Sharon? She's in Belfast, she's flying, she's getting in at 7 tonight. Yeah? She's doing the X Factor thing. Of course. What? And uh, how is she... How she... <laughs> what was that? A bit controversial there. How's that going, alright? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> you don't watch it either. There you are. Um, listen, mate, uh, we need to present you with this. I've got to bring the Lord Mayor on. We need to have a little okay. chat with the Lord Mayor. So, ladies and gentlemen, please, a uh, nice big round of applause for Councillor Randall Brew, who will be coming on stage. He has almost as much black and bling as Ozzy Osbourne. <laughs> Guys to the blue, blue, pleasure. Just stand next to each other, because they look, there's not that much difference, to be honest. Councillor Brew, very quickly, what do you think of this? Do we need a walk of stars in Birmingham? What do, we, you know, what do you think of it? We certainly need a walk of star, Elliot. And I can't think of anyone more appropriate for the first star, Ozzy Osbourne. He's been, star. He's been a star and a credit to this city for over 30 or 40 years, and it's great to welcome him back. Thank you. Right now, uh, we need to do the serious business, OK? Um, Ozzy, do you have anything to say? Before we do this, this is your opportunity to speak to your fans who come out to see you. This rain is the first bath double that we've had. Thank you very much for coming out. Um, I'm more than honoured to be here. I'm so, I'm so thrilled that I've got this star. It means more to me than the one I have in Hollywood. Uh, I'll try and get back here as often as I can. God bless you all. Thank you for coming out. It's over to you to do the honours and to uh, unveil the star and everything, so I'll hand it over to you, sir. Thank you very much, Elliot. Ozzy, ladies and gentlemen, I'm delighted to see so many of your fans here today to pay tribute to you. A lad born in, back in the 40s, and you've, come, you've always remembered the city. In spite of the fact that you've sold over 100 million records, you have a, a CV that would do a pop star, any pop star, or a statesman credit. You have, you've, you've, you've played in Live Aid, you've played at the Moscow Peace Festival, 
You were installed on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. You dined with President Bush, I understand as well. You played at the Queen's Jubilee. And you were installed on the Rock and Roll, US Rock and Roll Hall of Fame and numerous awards. But it is a great delight to welcome the lad from Aston back to Brom. And Ozzy, on this historic day for Birmingham and Broad Street, I would like to officially welcome Ozzy home and to offer you the honour of being the first star to be inducted on the Birmingham Walk of Stars, Broad Street. As Lord Mayor of Birmingham, I declare today, Friday the 6th of July 2007, Ozzy Osbourne Day! And it gives me great pleasure to present you with a replica of the star that I hope you will treasure and we'll go and unveil the proper star in a moment. Thank you. It's time to unveil the real thing, I think, which is underneath here. Do we have a... Come on, it's it's a what? It's a television. It is, it's what we got you. It's a, we got your big plasma, Ozzy. It's a bit off, don't tell anyone what we got it from. Right. Should we have a... Let's have a countdown from five, okay? We'll go backwards. On, on one, you need to pull it back. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one.